July 27, Monday of the 17th week in Ordinary Time, a reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. Jesus proposed a parable to the crowds. The kingdom of heaven is like a mustard seed that a person took and sowed in a field. It is the smallest of all the seeds, yet when fully grown, it is the largest of plants. It becomes a large bush, and the birds of the sky come and dwell in its branches. He spoke to them another parable. The kingdom of heaven is like yeast that a woman took and mixed with three measures of wheat flour until the whole batch was leavened. All these things Jesus spoke to the crowds in parables. He spoke to them only in parables to fulfill what had been said through the prophet. I will open my mouth in parables. I will announce what has lain hidden from the foundation of the world. The Gospel of the Lord Like a mustard seed, like yeast, Jesus was a master teacher. This is shown in today's two short kingdom parables of the mustard seed and the yeast. Great transformation results from the smallest of all seeds and from a bit of yeast. The change begins from within. The seed is planted in the ground and the yeast is mixed with the flour. Growth, change, and transformation in our lives as Christians begin with the small seed of faith planted at our baptism. As we cooperate with God's grace, its transforming power and effects are seen. This fact has been verified in church history. From a small band of ordinary disciples, the Catholic Church has grown into a worldwide community of 1.6 billion people. Beginning with one person, St. Mother Teresa picked up thousands of destitute people. Many people are attracted to the little way of St. Teresa of Lisieux. This means seeking holiness of life in the ordinary aspects of everyday existence. This approach puts holiness within the reach of ordinary people like you and me. How can I leave Jesus' call to discipleship in the simple daily events of my life?